Aaliyah and I am back with another video and as y'all can already tell by the title y'all already know what today's video is going to be about I am going to be sharing with you all what PJ and I are naming our daughter um but before we go ahead and get into the video make sure y'all like comment and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell so you can be alerted every time I drop in a video and obviously PJ is not here um he is at work but I did make sure that it was okay that I made this video without him um, <laughs> just because I am telling you all um, what we are naming our daughter and he said it was fine so I went ahead and made the video plus I was supposed to drop this video like two days ago and um, I don't know I just we both been really busy so yeah but before we get in to the good part of the video um i want to kind of update you guys on how she is doing and how i'm doing um i have my baby out y'all yeah i just like that's this how i'm feeling today this is my mood i'm comfortable i'm in the house i'm not going anywhere i'm not doing anything today um it's ugly outside as you can kind of see through the window the bottom um it's cloudy it's cold it's raining and it just kind of threw me off. My whole mood is just eh. I just kind of want to chill. Maybe watch a couple movies. And just rest, honestly. <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah. Um, everything is good with her and with me. We are blessed. We are healthy. Thank God. Um, everything's going well. Uh, like I said in the last video, I am five months along. Yes, as of yesterday, I'm exactly 19 weeks. So yesterday I turned 19 weeks. Um, she has been kicking me like crazy every day. Last night she was super active, like super, super active. And I think it was because all day yesterday I was just running around running errands. And I also had to work yesterday, but... Um, she had just been kicking me all morning yesterday and all afternoon and all night. And my mom told me she was like, she's going to be active. And she was like, that's because you're active, um, which I am. I just, I, I'm on the go all the time. I just go, go, go. Um, so, yeah, she's been super active. Just been kicking me like crazy and punching me. <laughs> Some punches in there, too. It's just not all kicks. Um, but it's the best feeling in the world. I love it. Um, something that I do every night, I try to do it every night, um, but most nights I will put my beat headphones on my belly and I have a playlist that I made for her specifically that I just let play throughout the night. Um, sometimes I fall asleep with them on my stomach. Sometimes I fall asleep and then wake back up and take them off. Um... But honestly, when I play the music, she just goes crazy. Like, And there are certain songs that she just kicks more to. Um, my favorite song to play for her is a song called Butterfly by Mariah Carey. It's an older song, but um, it's beautiful. So that's the song that, that's actually the song that my mom dedicated to me growing up and still dedicates to me. And it's kind of cool because that's now the song that I'm dedicating to my daughter. And it's a beautiful song. So if you haven't heard it, go listen to it. It's called Butterfly by Mariah Carey. Um, I play some Janae Aiko for her. I play some Beyonce. Um, Ed Sheeran. I like that song, Thinking Out Loud by him. Um, Aaliyah. I play Aaliyah for her a lot. Just a mixture of a lot of R&B, older R&B music, you know, stuff that just kind of speaks to your soul. <laughs> um, but yeah, y'all, she's, she's doing good. I have my next doctor's appointment on Friday. Um, today is Wednesday. So if you're watching this video, I just literally made this video and dropped it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I have my doctor's appointment on Friday. Um, that's the next ultrasound. I haven't seen her, like I said in the last video, since she was seven weeks and she just looked like a little blob. 
um, on the ultrasound screen. So I'm super excited to see how much she has grown and developed. I know that right now with this week, I use this app called Baby Center and it keeps track of like every single week and it tells me, you know, what she's the size of. Like this week, she's the size of a, a tomato. Last week, she was the size of a bell pepper. Like, it's so cute, but <laughs> um, she is exactly almost a pound. Almost exactly a pound. Um, she's the size of a tomato right now. And I know that it said this week, um, her brain is designating special areas for smell, taste, um, you know, her vision, hearing touch um so that's super exciting i i'm pretty sure the first time that she was able to hear me and pj was around 14 weeks that's when they say your baby can start to hear you and hear move you know just hear things that are going on outside of your belly so um her ears are actually in place like where they're supposed to be um, because when babies' ears are developing, they kind of stick out, and now they're in place where they should be. So that's exciting. I talk to her all the time. So does PJ. It's so cute. He talks to my belly all the time, um, especially at night when we're just laying in bed together. Um, but my mom does too. <laughs> and um, yeah, so I've just been super excited. I've just been kind of chilling. You know, she's kicking me right now. She always usually keeps me at the bottom, the very bottom, like on either the right side, sometimes the left side too. But yesterday she kept kicking me in this same spot right here. She kicked me like five times in a row and I was like, all right. <laughs> but best feeling in the world. I've just been kind of chilling, y'all. You know, just chilling. I haven't really been doing nothing, going to work, coming back home. I haven't been around, you know, people. Um, I did go to my dad's house the other day so my dad and my stepmom could see my belly. And they took some pictures of my stomach and it was nice to go over there. I haven't uh, seen my dad in a minute. And then I went over to my brother's house um, the same night as well. And uh, he got to feel my belly and you know see my belly and stuff but other than that y'all i just been i just been in the house resting well i haven't really been resting but i try to get at least like eight to nine hours of sleep last night i went to bed super early i went to bed at like 9 45 to be exact and i never go to bed that early <laughs> i went to bed super early i've been i get tired throughout the day like right now I'm tired. I just took a shower, but I'm tired. And I haven't been able to uh, take naps recently. So today I just kind of took the day to just kind of chill. I'm off today, you know, just kind of chill and just relax. So that's what I'm doing. But um, let's go ahead and get into the good part. I feel like I've been rambling long enough. I wanna go ahead and share with you all what we are naming her her name is so beautiful and actually me neither me or pj came up with her name my mom actually came up with her first and middle name um she is getting my last name and the reason why she's getting my last name is because this is specifically my first child and pj already had he has a son and um also because it's a girl you know if he was a boy he would automatically get PJ's last name without a question, without a doubt. But um, we were gonna give her PJ's last name at first, but then I kind of got to thinking. I was like, you know, I gotta, want, I want my daughter to have my last name. So um, and PJ was completely fine with that. So that's why we went ahead and chose my last name Jones. But anyways, okay. So her first name is going to be True, T R U E. And her middle name is going to be Amor. So it's going to be spelled A apostrophe M O U R. It's kind of like, you know, French, like for love or whatever. But um, 
yeah so true amor jones is going to be her name it's so beautiful i love it my mom could have not picked a better name for her um i'm absolutely in love with it everybody loves it everybody that knows loves it pj loves it i love it my mom obviously she picked it and my dad everybody loves her name um it's very unique i wanted her name to be unique you know i didn't want it to be something that was super common um, I was thinking, you know, more along the lines of, I don't know, when we were trying to come up with names, I was thinking stuff like promise and blessing and true and, excuse me, and, um, there's a whole bunch of different unique stuff, but something within that category. So her name is True Amor Jones. It's so pretty. So pretty. True Amor. Like, how pretty is that? Come on. But um, her name is beautiful, so I love it. We're excited, and yeah, yeah. Um, I'm probably gonna record the ultrasound on Friday, so you all can see how big she has gotten. I want to keep you guys updated and along this journey with me. I am going to do a labor and delivery vlog as well, so you all will be there when I'm there. <laughs> So uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep you guys updated on everything. I'm kinda I'm gonna document everything. You know, this is my first pregnancy, so everything's gonna be documented. Labor and delivery vlog will be coming, um, her nursery vlog, everything, clothes, baby shower. My baby shower is gonna be um in February, at the beginning of February. So um yeah, and I'll tell you guys the theme later on. But you guys, that is the end of this video. If you like this video, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit that bell so you can be notified every time I drop a new video. Um, so yeah, yeah now y'all know her name. True Amor Jones. So yeah, baby girl, I can't wait to meet you. Me and daddy are so excited. I love you beyond words. We both do. But, uh, all right, y'all, that's it for this video, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.